30 minutes, two lanes of 670 will shut down. Here's a live look at the area near Troost. Crews need to repair the bridge after an asphalt truck ran into it yesterday. Lanes will be closed for two weeks. The driver who caused this mess is in jail tonight. 41 Action News investigator Jessica McMaster reveals prosecutors believe he was drunk. Jessica. Yeah, Mike and Krista, the driver of this truck is 23 year old Shay Michael Thompson. According to the courts, Thompson was driving the asphalt truck with a blood alcohol level over the legal limit. Today we went to the company Thompson works for to find out how this happened. The 41 Action News Sky Tracker captured Shay Michael Thompson with officers taking a sobriety test Tuesday afternoon. Then minutes later, placed in handcuffs. The company he works for is Seal-O-Matic, based out of Kansas City. This is a major incident in our eyes. Um, you know, it's a safety hazard, so to us, that's a big deal. Prosecutors charged Thompson with driving under the influence after the asphalt truck he was driving smashed into a portion of I-70. Those repairs still being made today. The guys he was working with that day were shocked as well to find out that was the case. Miles Jabin is a supervisor at seal -Omatic. He says the company tracks their trucks and that Thompson didn't stop anywhere out of the ordinary during his shift. Jabin says Thompson has been with the company for less than a year, but that he's been a standout employee. He's a hardworking kid, um, really not something that I expected either, so it's really a shock. 41 Action News checked into the company but didn't find any major violations or previous issues. Thompson's record also clean until now. Now, the spokesperson for seal matic says they haven't even been able to talk with Thompson about the crash, but they tell me they have zero tolerance when it comes to substance abuse. I'm investigator Jessica McMaster, 41 Action News.